Hey guys, how's it going? I know this video is releasing a little later than the rest, but we do have the ninja banner here and we have some pretty cool units. So, speaking with Ninja Mystics. Alright, so this is everyone's like voluptuous choice here. It's Igrin, of course the daughter of Hawkeye here. Your orders? And of course they always make her like bursting out of her clothes, but you know, if that's what you like, that's what you like. Two new skills, dual flying, that's gonna be I've useful life. to buff anybody who um, is kind of a gen 4 or lower. You don't have to be quiet to Shinon again, quietly. because you he's already good, sure and, no and this time he's red well. bow, so he does compete with um, New Year's Anna. But it is an inheritable bow. Okay, inheritable red bow. Might is 7, Let's try to enjoy which this. is not great. Okay, so I do like this Every one. I thought it was Hinoka in the preview when they did the silhouette, but it is male Corrin here. And he's in the blue outfit, so I, I do like that as well. Not a whole bunch of new skills. Maybe some new inheritable weapons on this banner, you and one on Igrin. But so far, Corrin and Shinon, those are both inheritable. I think they did make Shinon way OP before with Deadeye. Now this is the marquee of the banner here. Looks good on you, Elise. The Corrin, the female <laughs> Corrin, and like the Elise. And it Corrin's is Green Tome Infantry, which we really need. There's not enough of those Green Tome Infantry. And two <laughs> different moves. I do like the animation for that. I do like the Sakura petals. Dual skill grants unit another action. That's great. Jorin? In Jorin? Shh! Quiet down! Tear him to shreds! Ah. Elise is so cute even when she says tear him to shreds. The only thing is like they released the original banner so you can finally get the original Elise, except she shares the color with Shinon, so you can't oh, you can't roll for Elise without rolling for Shinon here. Now Kind of the cool thing about this is if you look on this page, there's actually Shamir. Now, if you remember last year, we got Hannah, and Hannah, Ninja Hannah, was actually really strong, but it is being replaced by Ninja Shamir, and I do like this artwork. It is very, very cool, um, whoever the artist is, because we didn't get to see it in the banner preview. And it does arrive with version 6.0.0, so you're going to need to download an update from the app store let me know what you guys think though on these banners um because i know some of you might roll for igrin you know y'all y'all kind of need a horny bonk there but she does have good skills so nabata kanai plus four speed um inflicts defense resist minus four if she initiates combat she can attack twice so very similar to a brave weapon there um, unit can move to a space within two spaces of any ally within two spaces. So very close to ground orders. Um, she can do that. And because she's the flyer there, she does have uh, dual flying four. I think it might be air orders because she's a flying unit. But you know, one of the order skills. And now for Shinon, he's not as OP'd. He does still keep Deadeye, which is like... A required move if you're running any sort of bow units you need to inherit Deadeye it is so very very strong Ninja Yumi um, effective against flying foes yes inflicts defense resist minus four of unit initiate combat unit attacks twice if unit speed is greater than foe speed deals damage equals to 50% of the difference plus four so yes this is gonna be very good inheritable bow um, in fact, yeah, it is red bow, so Holiday Hannah, Anna can um, inherit it, New Year's Anna, but this is going to be replacing the Brave Bow if you have a red bow unit, so definitely, definitely worth checking out here. Um, the male Corrin does have an inheritable weapon, 
Again, unit attacks twice. Ninja N N Naginata here. And um, same thing as Shinon, basically you do attack twice and it, you do the deal the difference in your speed stats. He is a blue lance. So that's gonna be interesting because blue lance and there's not really kind of like a brave lance weapon that's competitive. So we'll see if this one becomes competitive. Ninja scrolls, this is the one everyone wants is the female Corrin and Elise. Ninjutsu scroll, I should say. Um, Grant plus four speed, yes, unit attacks twice. You kind of get the difference now, but the difference in speed is calculated at a 70% rate. So that's gonna be good. Uh, the far, the save far trace three, the SR far trace three though, that's gonna be the skill that you want as well. It is a green tome and we don't have a green tome that attacks twice yet. So Reinhardt has always been very powerful with Dire Thunder. I wonder if Corrin's gonna be in the meta for the same reason. Okay guys, let me know what you think and definitely probably check out Samir because Hannah was really strong last year. So she will probably be too. All right guys, catch you on the next one. Bye.